Uh, hi everyone, we have Vaibhav Mehra with us and uh, he's done two courses with us. The first one is Data Structures in Java and uh, the second one is uh, Web Development with Node.js and he just graduated last month and he was also the top performer of the course. Uh, one of the catch here is that uh, he got placed at Edelweiss and uh, not only this, he completed the first module which is the front end portion and he got an offer from Grand Thought in that time. And uh, last month he completed the second portion and uh, he got placed at Edelweiss. He's joining Bangalore this month only. So uh, congratulations Webber. Thank you. And uh, just uh, tell me uh, briefly, how was your uh, journey of cracking interviews and uh, how did you end up at Edelweiss? Uh, first of all, uh, when I was working in Green Clouds and Gurugram, yeah. I took the course of full stack web development in coding in Jazz. Mm -hmm. And uh, after completing the first module, I got an opportunity in uh, Grand Thornton okay. via the placement cell of coding in Jazz. And uh, in Grand Thornton, they asked me about the front end part in which they asked me about HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Okay. And when I completed the second module, mm -hmm. uh, I applied in Edelweiss, and uh, luckily I got placed in Edelweiss. And in Edelweiss, they asked me about the JavaScript concepts like prototypes, mm -hmm. closures, and constructor functions. And after that, they gave me an assignment, and in that assignment, they asked me to create a website okay. and write some code so that they can test me my ability. That is an amazing effort. And uh, how was your uh, course experience? My course experience was great, all mentors was great. I learned a lot from my mentors, especially from Urban Sir. They are amazing mentor. They uh, created, a, a, they created a, from scratch. They asked, uh, they told us how to create the basic uh, mm -hmm. server in Node.js. And uh, after that, uh, they asked us to create a Codial, uh, which is a social media kind of platform. So in that, I have created that project in which I use ExpressJS, MongoDB, and EJS, HTML, CSS. So you made a lot of projects yes. during the course as yes, well. Yes. Okay, that that sounds great. And uh, so you you're a work you're, you're a working professional, right? Yes. So a lot of our students who are working out there have problems and they're not able to manage time while they're doing the course. So uh, how did you manage your time and excel in the course as well? Uh, while going uh, to my office, I download all the video lectures okay. uh, in the app and I watch daily uh, in one hour and after that when I go to my office in lunch break also, I practice th those questions mm -hmm. and after that when I go home, I uh, revise that video, revise that course and practice those questions as well so that I know that how to perform that questions. Yeah, that's very hard working with you. Yes. Uh, I'm sure you manage your time so well. And uh, uh, what kind of projects did you make which helped you crack the interview? I made the three projects. Okay. First one is the portfolio website. This is created using the HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. This is mostly front end. Front end. This is uh, second project is the music player. Uh, this is a static or front end part of the music player uh, created using the HTML, CSS. Uh, third one is the Codial, which is a full stack uh, social media platform. Technology is used as ExpressJS, okay. uh, MongoDB, and uh, HTML CSS. Okay. Okay. And were these uh, projects asked during your interviews? Yes. Okay. Relatively, all co all the questions are asked uh, according to my projects. Okay. Okay. And uh, what kind of uh, topics were mainly asked in your interviews? Uh, in web development, uh, I applied for mainly web development. Mm -hmm. So they mainly asked the core concepts of JavaScript. Okay. And that's it. Okay. And uh, any other discussions that you had during the interview? Yes, uh, I had discussion regarding to my project. What okay. did I made uh, during my period of learning? Okay. So, uh, for anyone who is uh, preparing for his interviews or internships, so uh, what kind of tips would you like to give to uh, that person? First of all, uh, you have to practice uh, your DS algorithms in some coding uh, okay. platform like HackerRank. Or if you want to go in the web development field, so master JavaScript. Alright. It's very tough to master JavaScript, but go through the concepts very deeply. Okay. Uh, so that you can apply those concepts in the web development field. And in web development, if you want to go, then you can 
pop for a framework as well. Okay, and how uh, how different is uh, front end and back end like uh, in interviews? I would say. Uh, front end is uh, for like the UI part of the website, mm -hmm. and back end is to uh, save the data in the database and create uh, uh, the database. And, uh, mm -hmm. So, in terms of interview experience, because you uh, you applied for the front front end position in uh, Dank Talking, and uh, now you're a web developer in Edelweiss. So, how di different was the interview experience here? Uh, here they asked me about the, the, not only the HTML CSS part, okay. but they asked me about the JavaScript as well okay. and the uh, MongoDB. Okay. Okay. Any other tips that you would want to add? Uh, yes. Uh, if you want to got awesome job in market, then you have to practice really hard. Okay. And you have to go through your concepts very thoroughly. Thanks, Weber. Thank, Thank you. you so much, and we wish you all the best for Edelweiss. Thank you so much.